A former Baltimore Ravens cheerleader reaches a plea deal in her child sex case. Molly Shattuck admitted yesterday to engaging in sexual acts with her son's 15-year-old friend and accepted the plea deal to a fourth-degree felony rape charge. Authorities say she performed oral sex on the boy mm. at a rental home in Delaware on Labor Day weekend of last year. She reportedly offered to have sex with the boy, but he declined. Shattuck could face up to 15 years in prison after her sentencing in August. If she didn't accept the plea deal, she could have faced more than 50 years in jail if the case went to trial. She remains free right now on an $84,000 bond. She will have to register as a sex offender and cannot have any contact with minors with the exception of her own kids. Would you think worse of her if she was a man who raped a 15-year-old girl? What do you think? And you're a parent. You have two kids? Three, Three kids. Three kids. And my son's 14. Ugh. And I cannot even fathom. First of all, boys, teenage boys, like, Ugh, like, right. I don't get it. I don't understand it. But it's definitely a double standard. If it was a man with a younger woman, I definitely think the media would be a lot harder on that person. And it's it just as guy. equally bad, I think. Oh, obviously. Oh, yeah. Of I mean, even, obviously, yeah. Yes. I'm even more disgusted by it because I think she, okay, first asked the boy for his consent. Right. He says no. The fact that she even went and asked is disgusting. Mm -hmm. But the fact that he said no and then she proceeded to perform oral sex, it's just. It is a disgusting story, yeah. and I'm surprised that she's not getting more time for this. Mm -hmm. And I think, you know, if she does good in jail, then she may even get off with less time. I just think there certainly is that double standard there. Yeah, and yeah. it's even, I think, more of a heinous, heinous crime. What do you think, Ricky? It, you know, it's just one of those things, like, I don't think she should have got a plea deal. She should, right. she should be there for 50 years. Mm -hmm. Man or woman, it's wrong. I mean, it's these kids these days... You gotta, you know, be a role model to them. And her being a cheerleader, Thank so you. many right. people look up to her. It's like it, it makes me just sick to my stomach even yes. thinking about it. Do you remember the case out of Washington, Laterno, and she mm -hmm. it, it raped her, her student? Mm -hmm. yes. And that was just so. Yeah. It was the first time we heard about yeah. that in national news. It was disgusting. And this. And you're thinking she's a cheerleader. She mm -hmm. should know better. Mm -hmm. She's a mother, mm -hmm. and it's just awful t oh. to go through this. And she really needs psychological help of course, as well. Oh, yes. of course. That, oh yes. Why are her kids an exception? Why can she because be it's around her, own her children? Kids? Oh, okay. Well, you but the fact she's that still going to be a mother no. to her kids. But how? Do, I think how that's do, even more dangerous. How do they stop her from becoming a predator in the future towards her children's friends, though? Like, I don't get it. Yeah. Well, I'm sure she, I, th I think I read somewhere that she does have to stay away from kids and she has to register as a sex offender. So you, okay. it's not yeah. like you can have uh, kids over for trick or treating or birthday parties, or birthday parties yeah. and things like that. Well, when so you register she will as a sex to, offender, exactly, yes. that stays on your record. Mm -hmm. I want to say forever. To an yeah, she's been to an island. I mean, it's, it's seriously. It's I like just I fear for the kids because if she did this mm -hmm. to her child's friend, why wouldn't she do yeah, this to her kids? You never know. She's going to yeah. repeat uh, history again and do it yeah. again. So but sad. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, also trending here.